Welcome to the Arclight Battery, your power source for all things Warcraft Rumble related. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you the Sneed deck I used to climb from 3,000 to just under 5,000 in the span of an hour and a half or so. Um, this deck is wild. I've been completely wrong about Sneed. I thought random maps would kill him, but it is not the case. Sneed is awesome, and my first PvP video ever was about Sneed, so I'm very happy to be returning to him. Um, I can't wait to show you guys. So, let's go ahead and get into the build. Here we are. Here's the Sneed build. First, we have Sneed with Lead with Greed, which gains an additional 2 gold when Sneed triggers Sneed before Greed. Um, his leader ability says, you gain 2 gold when a Siege Damage unit destroys a tower, captures a Meaning Stone, or opens a chest. So, the goal of this is to use Sneed to either um, gain gold advantage through opening treasure chests, um, or using him to defend the tower and take back a tower that has been taken by your opponent to deal the collateral damage and gain six gold off of it. Um, it is crazy. Rather, um, sorry, four gold off the tower. It is nuts. Um, this is so fun. I can't wait to show you guys games. Anyway, we have sappers. I know I normally rag on sappers, but in collateral damage, if you get them through, they're too gold to take a tower and deal 20% of your opponent's max HP to their base. It is crazy. It's so good. And you get gold off of them doing that because Sneed is your leader. Next, we have Chain Lightning to counter other sappers, harpies, whelps, stun things. We have some very good use of Chain Lightning stun in this game to secure towers. Um, I'll showcase that in some of the PvP matches. We have War Song Raider with the Saboteur talent. Damaging a tower reduces damage by 50% for 3 seconds. We don't want Raising Focus here because we want her to be able to one-shot treasure chests for us and get the bonus gold from Steed. Um, we also don't really care about Sunder Armor. The only thing this really affects in the meta is maybe like a Downed Rend or a Baron, but it's like none of these talents are great. So we're going with Saboteur here. It's at least something to help. Next we have Glowbore. Um, Bristleback, great at... Defending against Baron, turning Rins, um, you know, it's Quillbore. It does that. And then Griffin Rider with the range talent, great at dismounting Rins, great at killing Welp Eggs at range, um, just great at really supporting and defending our bases. And then Safe Out with coming in hot. This is used to uh, kill enemy miners, claim treasure chests, kill harpies, kill groups of skeletons, um, all sorts of stuff. You name it, she does it. So, what is the way, or rather, how is... I can't talk. How do you play this deck? Well, the main goal is to try and set up Sneed to take treasure chests to gain that big gold advantage, then overwhelm your opponent with raiders uh, while supporting them with chain lightning and um, safe pilot. Now, you need to watch and see what your opponent does. When they play gold, too much gold, you run sappers down a lane and take a tower and deal a bunch of damage. Um, I think the best way to really showcase how to play this deck is just by showing you. So let's go ahead and get into the PvP games. They are wild. They are so fun. Alrighty, here we go. That's okay. We can play this one better than we did last time. Okay, we're gonna save our Sneed to retake this tower, and we're gonna get more Song Raider in the middle, I think. This is gonna try and contest here, but I think we can tank it here. And come get this pretty easily. This will probably kill this. Yeah. Get in there, War Song Raider. One more hit. Come on. You need to make sure we're keeping track of the timer. Okay, please hit this. Maybe this is too much gold invested. Get 
yes or no. Probably not good. We could probably could quill board that instead, honestly. We can do this into this. Pretty good tank for that. I would like for this to not kill my Griffin Rider, which is what it was gonna do. Don't know if that was worth it. What the? F We're the worst. We're the worst. We get that though. We take those all day. Push them out of the way. Get in there, sappers. All right, we managed to sneak that in, which is great. We don't have that for um, for whelps anymore, but I think that's okay. Come on, not quite, huh? I think this gets this. How in the world? It does not. Are we about to lose a bunch of gold here? Because I think we are by mistiming. That's kind of unfortunate. No, go sideways. Oof. We are maybe throwing now? Question mark? He's gonna take this at the very end, isn't he? Maybe not. Yep, this needs to take this. Please kill this, please kill this. Yes! Oh, that was very close. Let's go back and look. Oh man, we got the map again too. Okay, we don't have Sneed and it doesn't look like he's coming close. So we are going to play Warsong Raider, but we're going to play him way the hell back here. That should be able to get there. We are going to kill these, kill these. Not super worried about this. Now that he spent a bunch of gold, I think we can play Sappers here pretty safely. Get this, cycle back here. Nice Sappers, go, 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 go. Get the treasure, get it all. We can set up another Sneed after this now. Let's go ahead and get a Warsaw later here. Should be able to take this back if they end up getting it. Um, we're going to go ahead and set up a Sneed here. This is fine. This is fine. This should see this. Yeah. Um, we can safe pilot these and not worry about it too much. I want to be able to protect this, but I don't think he can do anything. He spent a lot of gold recently. Like, that will contest, but it should die. And we get the gold for it, yep. And then we get the sappers here. Oh, so much gold. Oh my lord, I don't even know what to do with all the gold, to be honest. These will go the long way if he decides to retake it somehow. But if not, they're just going to end up at his base anyway. And I think it's pretty well GG. Good game, Economic. Go, Sappers, go! <laughs> Ishano Afterlife. Okay, so we're not playing Sneed this game. Can you kick my butt today? <laughs> Only once or twice, I think. I think you took more off of me. The King of Gold, true. Man, Chain Lightning is so good with this meta. We're gonna go ahead and drop this. We're gonna play these, and I hope that he thinks that this will kill them. Nah, never mind. I was hoping he would think the Baron would kill them, and that we would get a free Quillboard distraction out of the deal. Uh, but that does not seem to be the case, huh? 
This is good because we don't care about this at all because Chain Lightning kills it. Go Sappers, go Sappers, go! Go Sappers, go Sappers, go! Go, 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 go! Whee! Um, I kind of want, well, that was a waste then, huh? This is good, though. Kaboom! This game's gonna play much, much slower, as it would turn out. No, thank you. Two gold for three gold seems good any day of the week. Oh, okay. Oh, he doesn't know which way he wants to go. I respect it, honestly. That might net us a gold. Come on. Yes! Good job. We're gonna go ahead and throw this here. We'll tank with this. We will uh, chain lightning here. And Warsong Raider should move past that, which is really good for us. That's gonna do a good amount of damage to his base. Can we cycle back to Chain Lightning? No, we cannot. So it's not gonna do hardly anything to his base, which is totally fine. We can kill these with Safe Pilot, no big deal. Would like to have my Miner up and running. I shouldn't have anything to deal with these, I don't believe. Go, go, go. Nice. That's a good chunk, that's good. This should kill all of these, I believe. These will die before anything happens. Go, Sappers, go! Go! Go, Sappers, go! Go! Alright. One more take. I think that tanks... Oh, uh, we're in tower range. Oh, well, we should still get it, I believe. And then we can play Griffin Rider, wait for this to hit our tower, and we should be good. GG, Ashana. The final boss is Jim. True. Although Calathumos is kind of up there. Oh, the final boss is Jim, huh? Okay, final boss Jim. This is so good for us. Dog Lightning, you're cracked. You're absolutely nuts. Not today, Jim. At least not right now. Oh my god. The plays. Look at the plays. Look at the moves. Baker, what was that? <laughs> Final boss, Jim is no more! <laughs> well, here we go, we can try it again. Although I don't think this is a very good map for us. Yep, so much gold value. Well, as you can see, <laughs> there's no gold value here. We'll do our best, but I don't believe in... I don't believe in the cheese. So, I think we let these take this, actually. Though it looks like the Prowler's gonna do it, so we might be okay here. There's the gold. We got the gold. That's probably not ever good, actually, unfortunately. I don't know why we decided to do that. This should kill this too, hopefully. Well, not this will. There's a lot of gold. Just run this through. We're gonna try and take this with sappers.
Nope, he didn't let us. Makes sense. Story checks out. Tank that. Get a little gold here, hopefully. Oh my god. We're actually crushing it. We're gonna stun this. Alright, GG Cali. Oh, not yet? Not yet? Just kidding? Sorry about the preemptive GG, I didn't mean it. We're gonna cycle back to... Our Chain Lightning. All right, GG Cali. Woo! All right, there you have it. As you can see, we played some very good players in this match, or rather, in this stream tonight. Uh, it was a ton of fun. There's a lot you can do with this deck, and it kind of depends on the map you get. Uh, Hillsbrad Hoodfills is very bad for you. Arathi Basin is also bad, but not as bad. It feels like you can defend your tower a little bit better uh, with Sneed. Um, using him to claim your towers back and get gold is just so good uh, and they're close enough that you can do that on this map not very long for sappers to run either so it just feels a little better and then the other three maps all have treasure chests so they are fantastic um guys we're closing in on 5k subscribers it's been nuts um i can't thank you enough it's been awesome so thank you so much for watching i hope you learned something if you have any questions please leave them in the comments uh also my last video has a giveaway on it because I'm a Warcraft Rumble partner. So if you haven't entered that, go check out the last video and, you know, try to win some cool prizes. So thank you guys so much for watching and until next time.